Hello, sports fans, sports betters, and YouTube Nation. John here with Rigget Picks. Got my co-host here, too. Um, just got done with the tree auction. Um, do a fundraiser every year for the uh, local hospital foundation. Actually, my wife does. I just volunteer to help her decorate a tree. And then the, all the trees have premiums. They auction them off for an insane amount of money. Uh, this year was our best year ever. Um, tree sold for 6400 bucks, so that's pretty awesome. But... Um, you know, and the little one helped us this year a little bit. She was there in spirit, kind of just being like, whoa, what is going on? This is pretty cool. All these lights. But, um, you know, okay, sports betting day. Um, up, got two soccer games left in action um, tonight. Some J1 and J2 action. Um, I like J1, J2 soccer, Japan soccer leagues. Um, they, they've treated me very well over the past year. And, uh, you know, if all goes as planned tonight, we'll have a winning day. Um, if it does not go as planned, there's a possibility for a losing day. It'll be a small loser. If not, it'll be an okay, decent winner if they do pull through. So, that being said, we're moving on to Saturday. There's a ton of action. I'm sad. I was pumped up my Ohio State. I was going to take them. I was on them. The first half, we were going to roll and rock it and pound it. And the game's canceled now because of COVID issues. Now with Ohio State. So... Shame on them um, for not keeping it under wraps. Uh, Cincinnati Bearcats, the other team I like to hit, they're kind of partial to Ohio this year. The Ohio teams used to live there, but, um, you know, the Cincinnati Bearcats are actually good this year. And, you know, lo and behold, their game's canceled also. So, where else do I go? Let's go to Washington. The Huskies versus the Utah Utes. Uh, dogs looking pretty good this year so far. Uh, they come in 2-0, I believe, on the season. They beat Oregon State, who, oh, by the way, just upset Oregon. Um, I think they had a pick six or something. I've seen some craziness going on, but um, haven't had a chance to watch any action at all today. Um, Huskies have beat Arizona 44-27. Actually pounded them. And then Utah has only played one game this year, and they got pummeled by USC. I shouldn't say pummeled. They got beat handily by USC. Bless you, baby girl. 33-17. to Um... On the season, the Huskies are averaging 440 yards a game. Um, obviously, they've only played two games. It's hard to get these averages out um, to mean anything, I should say. Um, on defense, they're not giving up 300 yards a game, so that's a pretty good defense in college football. And I think they're going to live on that defense in this game. The spread was at 7, and there's uh, must be some money coming in on Utah because it's went down to 6.5. So um, it's now um, Washington minus six and a half is minus 120. I'm going to lay that touchdown. I was going to lay the minus seven, but it went down to six and a half. So that's even a better number. We're going to take the minus six and a half as your official Ricketts gridiron pop pick for this game. So Washington Huskies minus six and a half. Minus 120 is what the number's at right now. We're going to put $50 on it, and that's what we're going to We're going to punch that ticket. As they say, then we're going to cash that ticket after we punch the ticket. So, if you guys have not already, hit that subscribe button, tap the bell, turn notifications on. You'll get the videos as soon as they drop. I need to go feed a little baby girl because she is starting to get hungry. And uh, I hope everybody has a wonderful day. Give me a big old thumbs up if you have not already. If you appreciate true free daily sports betting advice, you want to say you like the Huskies? She's, she's saying bow down right now. Can you believe it? Yeah, hear that bow down. That's what she's saying, bow down. Yep, go Huskies. All right, guys. Thank you very much for watching this video, and most importantly, good luck with your bets.